and welcome. It has been some time. <laughs> um, but yeah, I am back. Um, yeah, sorry for the lack of uploads and streaming. But yeah, I am... Well, like I said, I am, I am back to YouTube. Um, I will be streaming, like, soonish. Or I've already started. Because... Um, come to think of it, I think it's the 8th I'm going to start streaming, but YouTube is later on in the April. But anyways, <laughs> I'll either, I have either started streaming or I haven't yet. Alright, let's just end that. <laughs> but um, yes, um, things have a bit changed and uh, I hope you don't mind the, the changes and everything else. But um, basically, um, the format of these costume reviews are a little changed, so I'm trying to make this intro as short as possible. But yeah, it's basically the format's kind of a bit changed a bit when it comes to, you know, basically arranging it. So basically, it's the little intro and then me wearing the costume immediately, you no know, like detailed review first. And then it's the detailed review and then it's like, here's my, here's my little score and my thoughts. I hope you enjoy the content and like I said I have planned to do a lot. Also yes this is now a costume related channel if you want to see like me play games still um, you know you can join me on my Twitch channel or my new Twitch YouTube channel which will be linked in the description. Um, so yeah basically all game content will go there instead. Right here is the inflatable shark in action as you can see um it does get in your face <laughs> it does get quite in your face but it's kind of kind of is meant to here it is from the side which is normally the best view as you can see so if you get in eaten by for I'm going to just try something, because I've never actually tried this, but uh, I'm going to try it out. I don't know how this is going to work. Maybe, maybe if I do this, I will. <laughs> you might, you might, you might see what's going to happen. Right, hold that with one hand, but I suppose to keep the air in. Right, and then, let me see. <laughs> <laughs> Does it really work? Right, I'm gonna go. Un I'm gonna go under and see what. See if I can do something else with it. Because I'm, I'm just trying things out right now. You know. Oh good, that's the thing, I haven't show, I showed the front and the side, but here's the uh, back which also looks quite nice in my opinion, it doesn't look too bad, and kind of has this weird Robloxy looking look to it in my opinion with the uh, bottom bit, you know where your legs are near, looks weird, <laughs> okay. There we go. There's this shark done, I suppose. <laughs> oh, my hair's getting in my way as well now. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the thing. If I raise my arms, it kind of more eats me. Right? I, I'll yeah, I'll do it from the front just because it's just so you can see in a way. Right, here we go. 
<laughs> See? <laughs> I don't quite like this available shot. It's good. Now, I'm, I'm planning on modifying this costume in the future, right? I would normally say this on the, uh, you know, the uh, basically going into detail, um, you know, part of my review, right? Um, but basically, I think it would be more better to kind of a little bit show what I'm going to be trying to do, right? Yeah, basically like this. I am playing on basically getting rid of the, the hand hole, right? Which I suppose will make um, zipping this up and maybe slightly getting out a bit harder. But I plan to do this, which I think looks a little bit more better, you know? It's like, it kind of increases the uh, sharp look but I'll even do it on the wait, hold on. I'll even do it on the other hand the other arm so you can have a greater understanding I suppose a better look of what I'm planning on doing in the future with this basically like this you know we we can't really uh, you know Come on, this, this looks much more better, right? Not <laughs> without the hand showing. <laughs> all right, that's that's all I'm doing. This one doesn't have really any like features um, of note. Um, but I will say, yes, it is like an elastic, elastic band for when you put your head in through the mouth bit. Um, but with the uh, teeth of the shark, basically it is using um, like a eye mesh material. And so, yeah, it's very like, you know, you can see lots of holes. And I don't know why they use that material. Honestly, they could have just used something more solid and less like see through -y colour. Um, but yeah, it almost looks like a bit of tissue paper has just been attached. That is kind of what it looks like. And I'm just realising I need to move that up. <laughs> Sorry if the audio was a bit terrible. I need to put that there. As you know, that records my audio. That does my video now. <laughs> no longer video with the my phone. Anyway, <laughs> enough of that. And now on to the last point I can make with this, because like I said, um, there's no like redeeming features, it's quite basic and I can't really talk about like the vision and the eyes and all that such because, you know, you put your head through it. So, you know, like I said, the costume is kind of around you and slightly on you, um, but the zipper is at the front. Of the costume which normally normally costume makers put at the back so just so you know if you're looking for the zip when you first if you do buy this um, it should be at the front of the uh, costume itself and um, and the zip handle is uh, quite teeny like honestly um, actually it kind of looks a bit bigger than camera but honestly it's much more smaller than it looks to be honest but um yeah basically quite a simple um costume um like i said I, there is no like you know information like you know key points i can point out to you with like special detail because like i said it's like i said quite simple with only like like i said weird teeth design um well let's just go on to you know the review bit now it is time to give this costume its rating, and I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. So the pros to this costume is that, well, it is quite a nice idea of it eating you alive, making it quite unique. Like, for real, there is, there is like, some ones, but there hasn't been, like, an inflatable one that's done this design. So, like I said, it's quite more unique, um, and it is very, very fun to wear, like, um, probably one of the best fun to wear inflatable costumes I own and I quite enjoy messing around in it because I don't know it just gives off that silly vibe and I tend to be silly in it as well so it kind of just works 
like I said, quite fun. The air is also nicely contained inside the suit, so the suit can definitely handle like hive movement action um, as well as the very like you know light movement and slow movement speeds. So yeah, you can basically bounce around and do whatever you like because uh, yeah, it's quite it is quite airtight in there. The cons of this costume is, well, it is hard to see in front of you, but the sides are a lot more viewable, so your vision is only really great if you look at the sides. Also, the small zip handle causes it to be hard to get in and out of, and um, the zip handle has also jammed on me a few times as well, so that's a bad mark on this shark costume though. <laughs> like, seriously, it kind of isn't placed well, and it's kind of ripping into the the connection of where the zip is um but you know not you know inside the suit itself so uh yeah and the last con of this costume i can bring up is well it does have some questionable material choices that ruin the overall design of it but not by a ton because it is it is noticeable like i said you know like i said like tissue paper look weird thing and you know it it, it it does have its uh, weird choices, but um, basically it still holds up, so this isn't a huge con to make, but basically um, a little bit nitpicking, I suppose, but whatever, you know. Some people, like myself, want good quality in these costumes, you know? hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, yes, you will probably be seeing this outro three times at least. Uh, because um, to save a bit of time on editing and trying to get all these videos ready and also me trying to get my stream ready to you know make make it a bit more easy on me to try get back into YouTube and everything else um, yes I am basically using this review outro like three times so sorry if you get fed up of this exact same intro out uh, with this exact same outro i'm sorry i'm just trying to make it a little easier for myself of course in the future i'll be putting a lot even more bit effort so honestly i won't be doing this kind of like repeat of the outro thank you for watching and hope to see you in whatever video that might be